Hi, David Zaritsky for James Bond Lifestyle Video Podcast. Well, I've gone to some exotic and very nice places like the Bahamas, and this place is no different. Welcome to Target. You see, we've got a challenge ahead of us. See, I'd like to think that you can find James Bond Lifestyle anywhere. So someone put it up to a challenge. Can you find it even in a place like Target, which for our purposes today we'll call Target. So until we get kicked out by security, why don't we go in and find out if we can find the James Bond lifestyle. So we're here in Target's menswear, menswear right now. It's amazing how you can actually traverse all the way from Sean Connery right through to Daniel Craig and pick up different clothes. For example, you could put together something very simple like the end of Casino Royale when he's got his gray t-shirt on. Uh, this is extremely inexpensive. It's just Hanes Premium, but it feels like a sun's belt, very light, with a plain front khaki pair of pants. It's very simple. You pair it together. You've got the outfit when he and Vesper are on the boat in Venice. Come on, come on. This way. More goodies this way. Okay. So we've got to give Brazen his due. Maybe you like the Brazen era. I do. You want to dress up like him. Well, here you've got a Milano Bay shirt that looks just like the one from Die Another Day. Almost verbatim. For $20. Pair that with a black slim fit Morona pants. These are also $20. So for $40, you are now representing the Brazen from Die Another Day. Okay. If you can all remember the scene from GoldenEye when Brazen's on the beach and enjoying himself, he's wearing a linen shirt. Um, that's when he first goes into the Z3. Well, sure enough, at Target they've got linen shirts. This one's $19.99. It's a fairly good quality linen, certainly enough to roll around on the beach. It would be absolutely perfect. So, getting back to Brosnan. Oh, come in. This is good. So who doesn't like the Daniel Craig style, right? Uh, especially from Quantum of Solace. So here we have um, different color uh, jean khakis, if you will. Um, if you want to do the white one to make it look like one of the outfits that he has when he goes to fight Mr. Slate, so be it. These are 30% off, so it's about $10. And then pair this with a rather sunspell looking shirt, which is $12.99. Uh, this one's by Morona, and you start to capture the look. Again, you can go from white to khaki, depending on how accurate you want to be. If you really want to get cute, let me show you what you can do. You can start to play around with looks. So take that same shirt, for example, that would have been your sunspell, and pair it with these Mosino Supply Companies that fairly replicate Seven of Mankind, certainly on a budget, and these, um, with the 30% off and everything, are $19.99. So the whole look, for about 30 bucks, you've got the desert scene from Quantum of Solace at the very end. Pretty neat. Well, let's continue. Okay, this is cool. When M and Bond get together at the one and only, and he's wearing the Sunspell shirt, and those, what looks like Ted Baker jeans, if you will, they're not quite linen, um, they have a slim cut Verona, the ultimate khaki, $19.99. Again, put the whole thing together, $30. You've got the one and only Daniel Craig outfit. So it's coming together quickly. I think we've already found about five or six outfits. But I don't think we're done yet. If you want something that's, uh, if you want something that's a little more fitted than the other one, you can go for the Champion Golf Shirt, which has the cut-off sleeves. They're cut off a little bit higher, like the Riviera ones, and it's a little bit softer. Now, I know what you're thinking. Here we are at the suits over here right now, and why would you buy a suit at Target? But the reality is sometimes you need a good suit that you can walk in the rain, not worry about it, or you're going to be doing a lot of activity. Or, Well, they have suits like this that kind of take on the look of Quantum of Solace. The secret to getting a suit at Target is to get one size down from you. So normally I take a 41 or 42, but in this particular case I would take a 40, so the shoulders are a little tighter. 
and it gives it a more fitted appearance. And by the way, they actually do have very soft, wide collared shirts, so you can replicate a Tom Ford. Now, is it a Tom Ford? Absolutely. But this jacket, for example, is $38. This shirt is $20. So you can be extremely economical. And by the way, I think I could go a size down to a 38. So try them on and make sure that you get the plain front, not the pleated pants. Sorry to break it to you, no La Perlas. I can't find anything shorter than like, I don't know, 48 inch swimsuit, so do not get your swimsuit at Target. Let's move on. The Bond does not wear t-shirts. Let's pass this over here. And instead, we're gonna poke into the Connery era. So, as you can see, they offer a wide variety of hats. Now, I will tell you that during the fall and winter, they have a lot more selection of hats, but, you know, you could start to get that kind of look, the Connery look, if you will, um, in Thunderball. You could start putting things together. Um, this looks like it could pass for one of those hats. They have usually some very, very good straw hats. It's very light right now, but you could start to put, for example, um, something like this, together with a Slazenger or even a purple sweater in the right thing in the right time of the year and sure enough you've got the uh, Goldfinger hat. You could replace the band if you want to get really picky or you could just leave it the way it is but this hat for example is $14.99 probably one of those v-neck sweaters over there that's purple $12.99 a black pair of pants some black shoes over there you've got the whole outfit for under $50. Go play some golf. Don't forget, you've got to hold up your pants. Uh, they've got some really good alternatives to the Prada belt, which is hundreds and hundreds of dollars. Um, this particular one right here is $19.99. Makes a nice alternative. Doesn't have the cross hatch, but it's close. Here's another one that looks like the Golden Eye one. And then this one's pretty cool because it looks like the one from Casino Royale where he's up on the crane. Pretty neat. So whether it's chasing through the rooftops of Italy or just coming to Target, you can get almost uh, the same look of the Church's Presley for only $34.99. Now these, I don't know how long they would last, but you know what, in a pinch, and if you squint really hard, they'll do the trick. So sue me. I know I'm in the bra section, but I needed to get a quiet place because the sunglasses are very popular. But as you can see, there's some great alternatives to sunglasses here. Incredibly inexpensive. $14.99 Dronas look just like the Quantum of Solace ones, even with the little bridge right here. Um, you may be more the Sean Connery type. They've got a very simple Wayfair, $12.99. And lo and behold, you're sporting the Sean Connery Thunderball look. They even have those cat glasses that everybody's looking for. And something very close to her parcel from Casino Royale. So, I mean, you've got a little bit of everything here. Um, you could probably put together at least five or six different Bond movies with the types of sunglasses here. So, take your time. As you can see, there's a lot. But go through, and you'll find quite a bit. I'm going to get out of this section before people start talking. It's bad. Do you think you can fight yourself? No. So as you can see, it's amazing how much James Bond lifestyle gear you can pick up at Target. I hope the next time you go to Target or Kmart or Walmart, you have a little fun. you got to use your imagination. These clothes don't take the place of Tom Ford or Brioni or Turnbull and Asser. It's not meant to be. But for the budget conscious or if you're looking for something more rough and tumble, it's the perfect budget alternative. Until next time, this has been David Zeritsky for James Bond Video Podcast Lifestyle Something Something. Take care.